Well, we have a story tonight out of Salem that should make people break out their $100 smiles. First News reporter Jason Thompson joins us here in the newsroom or here in the studio with exactly what this one is all about. Jacob. Thanks. And Salem police were charged with a special task. Give a $100 bill to whomever could use the money. I started crying because I was honestly shocked. What could you do with $100? Salem Police Department is helping certain members of the community. Handing out $100 for people that really need it. For people like Katie Hergenroder, that was not what they were expecting. And an officer pulled out behind me. I was pulled over for a burnout headlight, and instead of giving me a ticket, I got secret Santa by Salem Police Department. While police may have heard people talk about their tight grocery budget. And we started shopping, we got to the register, and my husband was standing with my daughter in the stroller. And they walked up to him, and I looked, and I saw they were standing by him, and they, like, used that police voice on him, like, how are you doing today, sir, kind of thing. And I was like, oh, no, what did he do? After the officer handed over the money, it was nothing but pure emotion. Um, I gave him a hug because <laughs> I was not expecting that. Here it was a $100 bill that they gave us, and we just, like, stood there in shock, and we started, like, joking about me thinking he was getting picked up for something. He wanted to cry. We didn't know what was going on. We were like, what's happening? Um, we were so excited, so thankful. Some of the people I've already talked to said they've already spent the money. We were able to actually go and get more things that we needed at the house and put some money back for gasoline. And for Hergen Rotor, she got her taillight fixed that night, but with her own money. That $100 is going towards something else. I'm actually going to be buying a Christmas present for my boyfriend's daughter, and the rest of it is going back into the community for Angels for Animals. Now, I did speak to Salem's police chief, J.T. Pansot. He didn't want to comment today, but he said the station received the money from a donor. That donor's name will be kept private. Live in the studio, Jacob Thompson, WKBN 27 First News.